and um, I don't know if I'll be done in 15 minutes but I pray I'll be done in 30 minutes yeah welcome thank you so much for having me today thank you Ruth for this platform um, I just got to know that it's an NGO and um, I also um, founded an NGO for pregnant women and um, it's amazing to be here I'll try and be done as quickly as possible. I'm talking about personal development, right? Yeah, personal development is a topic that um, is applicable to everyone. There is no single person, health professional or not, that does not need personal development. As long as you are a career person, you are a business person, you are a growth-minded person, and you want to actually um, give more to the society. You want to give more to your patients. You want to give more to, um, you want to impact lives. Personal development will be something that you want to talk about, right? So, um, I have a presentation slide. If it's going to be, it's going to be uh, projected here. But if you need the presentation, um, my contact is available. I'm a public person, I'm not a private person. So you can always reach out to me. I'll send you the presentation, right? So that you can go through it. Because 15 minutes will not do justice to the kind of impact I intend to make this evening, right? Yeah, so what is personal development? Personal development basically is self-improvement. Simple. You don't need a, a very big dictionary to pass across the message of personal development. And I believe that maybe 80% was here already have come on the journey of self-development of working on each um, on it or herself yeah to become a better person now why do us professionals need personal development why am I here you need personal development because you want to be a better person because of your patients and because of yourself and because of your family right you cannot afford to be on one spot if you want to give the best right now um the nursing profession especially in nigeria is suffering a setback because a lot of nurses do not pay attention a lot of health professionals do not pay attention to personal development they discover that after 15 years 20 years 40 years of giving and giving and giving and giving and giving and giving nothing is left of them because they are not working on building themselves. So you need, whether you are a student nurse or you are a practicing nurse, whether you are 50 or you are 55 or you are retiring tomorrow, right? you need to pay attention to personal development. So now personal development is something you do consciously. You cannot engage in personal development without being conscious about it. It's not an unconscious activity. It's just like praying. You cannot unconsciously be praying. Do you understand? It's something that is conscious and you consciously pay attention to every aspect of your life. So now, if you don't take anything from everything I'm going to say this evening, this is something I need you to take away. And please don't forget it. Every month of the year, ask yourself, what is my personal development focus? Please, if you don't take anything away from this gathering tonight, take that away. That, oh, not only of Step Up Nurse Academy, said one thing. I did not remember, remember any other thing she said. But she said that January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, till December of every month, you should have the focus of something that you want to do for yourself to grow. Right? I believe that the founder of EP is here and she started this NGO because she wants to provide a platform and a venue for people to grow. And if you're here and you're a student and everything that you're thinking about is how to make money or how to jack back, sorry, you are not living, you're not going to be living a feeling life. I usually tell my friends that out of the country um, something. What is the effect of all the money you have? Like you are earning salary just for yourself. I'm not, I've not said anything in my slide, trust me, except the definition, right? Um, 
putting forward the synopsis because 15 minutes cannot do justice to personal development. Right? I started SNA, Step Up Nurse Academy, basically because of personal development. Not because I want to teach you nothing diagnosis, I want to teach you nothing care plan. You already have that in school. Your tutors, your lecturers are handling that perfectly. So I'm not here to bring an extension of, oh, come and learn how to pass research or how to learn, uh, how to pass, how to um, draw up a nursing care plan, right? Because that has been handled. Now, I'm handling that part that you may never think about or that you may never pay attention to all your 35 or 60 years working as a nurse. Please don't wake up one day, aged and fragile, and discover that, oh, what did I actually really, really do? Trust me, if you saved the life of a patient one day, and somebody happened to document that happening, somebody just mistakenly videoed you while resuscitating a patient, and you happen to watch that video, just one minute video, you happen to watch it when you were 55 years old. You break down and cry. Now that person that videoed that thing, learned a skill, and decided to use that skill to help you in a way, to keep a memory that you will never forget, a memory that people will watch and be inspired. Your life as a nurse should inspire other people. But your life will not be an inspiration if you don't work on yourself. If you don't ask yourself every month, what is it I want to do? There are different areas of personal development. You can look at the clinical skill development. You can look into interpersonal relationship. Right? Good interpersonal relationship makes you a better nurse. Right, ma? Yes! Because you cannot go, I'm going to learn everything, nothing. And then when you graduate, you become RN and you get on the on the job, you discover that you need empathy. You discover that you need more skills that you you just discover. You know, it just keeps happening every day in your presence in the clinic house. And if if you don't grow, you will discover that nothing has really happened to you. You were just doing vital signs all your life. Right? So you need to make um, get a jota. I want to go to the practicality of this. Get a jota and tell it personal development. Put the different muscles in it. You need and ask yourself, what have I done this month? Your bank says, see what you can do this day. Emotion. What have I done my life to do? What extra thing, apart from eating, waking up, sleeping and drinking your food? Right? Am I young? To develop myself, myself, and be uh, a different in the life of people. I train people in SNA to become better writers. If you are a and you are a good writer.